morning. Today is Monday, September 23rd, 2024. I'm Dave Landry's Mark Let's go. Well, peace out off a bit on Friday. Didn't recover close off their worst level. So far, their breakout remains attack. Obviously, though, I'd like to see some upside follow through. We come back below 56.50. Then all bets are off. Take a look at Nasdaq stalling right at its prior peak. So that is a bit of a bummer. Rusty kind of same as it ever was. Down a bit on Friday. Kind of wide and loose and mostly sideways. Some of these areas that have been strong are stalling at the prior high. So we'll have to keep an eye on that. And other areas that have just pulled back so far still look pretty good. But any additional weakness would be of concern. Sorry, that's major drugs. Semiconductor stalling shy of the prior peak, so that's certainly a bummer. Wide and loose and sideways for now. Home builders did break out to new highs recently, but have since pulled back. If they pull back below their prior breakout levels, that would be of concern. That goes for many other areas, such as the financials. Some areas still looking pretty good. Take a look at the utilities. Bam, winning. Breaking out to new highs with a bit of vigor. Gold, the commodity. Bam, winning. All time highs there. Gold stocks beginning to wake up a little wide and loose and sideways, but didn't manage to close that brand new high. So, what do we do? Well, as usual, follow through will be key. If the P's come right back, and then all bets are off. I sure like to see the Nasdaq get past resistance in some of these stronger areas. I'd like to see them bang out some new highs. So for now, I'm not seeing a whole lot of setup. So let's just sit on our hands and see if we can get some follow through. Any questions, as usual, Dave, Dave, I'm Dave Landry. You can start a walk in a minute.